Hey, what is going on everybody and welcome to Fantasia for today. We're going to be jumping into another session of Epic 7. Now today, we have some more RTA for you guys. Now normally, I don't jump into preseason placements or anything like that um, right after an actual season has ended, but I just have the itch to play some RTA and as you can probably see on your screen right here, we have a couple of units that we're waiting to test out. So let's go ahead and See if we can actually draft some of them uh, against our opponents today, right? <laughs> um, but by the way, preseason is a fantastic time to just get into uh, get into the game, right? Get into the um, the RTA scene, and I think a lot of people are scared, right, of of pushing for ranks in RTA, but really. You can have negative win rates and you can still do very, very well. Look at this guy, right? No FCC skin. You could have gotten the FCC skin if you played RTA last season, right? See, like, just just like that. Okay, but uh, what do we do against FCC here? Um, Alright, let's see. We're gonna need... Ooh, actually... <laughs> I, think, I think I know what I want. I think I know what I want to do against him. Uh, but let's go for this. Let's go for Alencia. And let's go for... Let's go for the Fire Cecilia, right? Let's bring... Let's bring his, uh, his mirror match into him. Ooh! Ooh, we have a Quirk! Oh, we have a... Uh, Landy? Okay, interesting Landy right there. Um, Quirk's actually very interesting too. Yeah, I want to I use some fun units here. Let's use some fun units. So, what else do we bring? What else do we bring? Um... What's good against Landy, right? We need someone who's decent. Oh, actually, I have a nice Tempest Surin. My Tempest Surin has been looking really good lately. Uh, Regeared her, and she's she's pretty much optimized at this point. Let's bring T Surin, right? Let's bring her for fun. Uh, what what can I bring against a Coric? What's good against Coric? Ooh, I can actually I can go Kisei here. I can probably go Kisei, right? Is there anyone else I can bring? Actually, you know what? Let's go for Fairy Tail Tenebria. I actually re-geared re her too. She's gonna be quite fun. So let's see how she does here. I re-geared her. Um, who else? Who else? We'll see what he picks here and we'll respond. Ooh, a Rowana. Interesting stuff. And a -Roz. I don't know how I feel about a -Roz there. Um, what, what can we bring into this? Uh, a -Roz. I mean, I could just last pick... Fl no, I need a damage dealer, right? I need a damage dealer. Who do I bring for damage? Uh, let's bring LQC. Let's bring LQC here. I re-geared my LQC as well, and she is looking fantastic. Very, very bulky here. I think I ban... Landy? No, we ban Rowana, right? Let's just take out the sustain. Let's take out the sustain. I'm confident in my units here. Ah, very nice. He banned the F10A. So we are looking pretty, pretty strong here, I think. All right, let's do this. Uh, okay. So let's see how this goes. We should be taking turn one here because my units are pretty fast. Okay, never mind. That Korok is faster. But you know what? That's okay. Um, he doesn't have any souls. He can't soul burn here. But he's probably gonna reset. Yeah. Oh, he reset my he reset my Cecilia. Very sad. Very sad. Uh, so let's go for this. No defense break. Very sad. <laughs> Very sad all around, guys. Alright. But you know what, we're not taking placements very seriously here. Um, just gonna have some fun, especially it's preseason, right? It's just for you to test out new comps, new units. So, this would have worked out, I think, uh, if the Quirk did not outspeed. But hey, that's a pretty pretty nice Quirk there. Uh, I think he has potential, right? Quirk is a unit that has potential, you just have to invest into him. He needs good gear, he needs Molagoras. Um, Alright, let's see if we can get rid of this uh, Landy here. Can we silence her? Right now I'm trying to go for the silence, that's why I'm using the S3. Ah, uh, only the unbuffable. Uh, I, I didn't want her to use her S3 here, but... Oh, well. That's okay. Let's hope she doesn't crit my Cecilia. Uh, very nice. 
T Cerns, oh T Cerns could get knocked out of stealth here, which actually sucks. But Unbuffable's on the whole team, so there's no reason for her to S3, unless her goal is to knock me out of stealth, right? Okay, so not going for that. Uh, everyone's focusing down my Cecilia. Very interesting. Uh, let's go for this. As you can see, my LQC 17,000 HP. Um, same maintains the same exact damage she she had before. Okay, good. Korok died because of splash damage. Um. Aeros is gonna S2, but again, they're unbuffable, right? So no immunity buffs or anything here. Quite nice. And t is still in stealth, and he doesn't have AoEs, which is good, which is good. Oh, nice. Defense break. Okay, very, very nice. So I'm gonna go ahead and finish off this Landy here. She's like, oh, she resisted! She resisted my defense break. Okay, so we're gonna have to... Oh yeah, and my t is not a Moonlight Dreamblade anymore. She's on uh, Alexa's basket, so there we go. Hey, look at this. Defense buff from Alencia. I really love uh, Alencia with um, Fire Cecilia. And I actually love LQC as well because of uh, because of the immunity that I get. Uh, my Fire Cecilia is actually on Bastion right now, so LQC gets, uh, gets Bastion. Oh, wait, no. LQC doesn't. Yeah, LQC gets Bastion in this comp because t Cern's attack is lower. Very nice. So there you guys go. Uh, debuting Fire Cecilia there. Quite nice, quite nice. Now, uh, let's see if I can debut Kawana in this video as well. We're gonna try to do um, five placements, I think. Five placement matches, and then we'll do the other five in a different video. All right, I don't want this to be like an hour long uh, video here. We'll see how things go. All right, that, went, that match went by pretty quickly, and Fire Cecilia actually survived there. You saw how hard they were trying to focus her down. She's actually quite a scary unit because of her, uh, because of her kit actually gave her molas and everything too. The only thing I'm missing is a few more molas in her S1, but I'll try to get her to friendship 10 before I before I get that there. Ooh, actually, do I wanna Yeah, we'll we'll ban that. We'll see. Oh, he banned Arbiter Vildred, okay. Uh, let's see what he first picks here. Let's see if we can use our uh, FCC skin, right? <laughs> see if we can do that. Ooh, F10A. F10A, very interesting. Um, what would I want here? I think I would want Fire Cecilia here, actually. It's a little weird, but Fire Cecilia has immunity. So I'll go for Fire Cecilia here. And I'll probably, if he goes more debuffs, I'll pick like Kitty and Champ Z somewhere. But let's go for, let's go for the... Let's keep testing this combo, right? Fire Cecilia and Alencia. I really like it because Alencia can strip, and then Fire Cecilia can AoE provoke the whole team. So we'll see. We'll see what, what happens here. Uh, Lilius, interesting. All right. Not not really sure why the Lilius is there because there's no real cleanse. Oh, whoa! Hang on, hang on just a second. She's actually good against Champ Z, because Champ Z can't counter any of her things, because she doesn't land debuffs on Champ Z. Um, yeah, I, I can't, I don't think I can use Kawana here, there's too many ice units already. This is one of the downsides of fire units, right? Ice units are so prevalent in, uh, in the meta. I could go for Charles here, actually. <laughs> Why don't we just troll with Charles here? Yeah? Let's just troll with Charles here. It's an early Charles pick, but I don't care, right? Let's go for it. I feel like this will be fun. And you know what? Let's go for Kitty Clarissa as well. And let's see Let's see what happens down here. Um, yeah, I'm not going to ban the F10A. Ooh, he's going for Rowana. That's actually quite smart, because Alencia's dual attacks and Charles has dual attacks, right? But why is he going for Holiday Yuffie? Is this a damage Euphine? If that is, I'm gonna be in trouble, right? So... Uh... Ooh, what do I do? What do I do? I can't pick Champ C as Rowana. Or I could pick Champ C. You know what? Let's pick Champ C. Why not? Let's pick Champ C and let's ban Rowana. We'll deal with everything else, right? We have two units to counter his uh, debuffs. We have Charles for damage, Alencia for damage, and uh, Cecilia's gonna be there to give immunity Hopefully he doesn't ban the Kitty Clarissa. Oh, actually he banned the Fire Cecilia. Very interesting. 
Probably not what I would have done. No, probably not what I would have done. <laughs> but you know what? That's okay. My my goal was to go for the immunity um, buff on Fire Cecilia after I cleanse with my Kitty Clarissa. Oh, but that's a slow that's a slow F10A. That is a slow F10A. -E. Okay. Well, we're gonna go ahead and do this anyway. We're not gonna. Um, we're not gonna S3 with our Kitty Clarissa here, I don't think. I could go for an S2 to strip, but I don't think I need to do that yet. We'll we'll wait to strip like any buffs he puts up later. Uh, let's go for this. Okay. So, Charles still has immunity. Champion's Zerato can't be stunned, so he's gonna go for S3. Kitty Clarissa has 300 resistance, so she can never be hit by this, uh, by this Ida. Oh, oh, Charles! <laughs> He's been waiting on the bench for so long. He's like, finally, this is my time to shine. All right, he's gonna push his team up, which is fine. Not much, not much from that, but this team's pretty tanky, right? Unless he focuses down Kitty Clarissa here. Okay, no, he's not. He's gonna go for S3. Again, can't push Kitty or anything back here. And I highly doubt, unless this is a DPS, unless this is a DPS um, F10A, which I think it might be because it was so slow, it might be actual actually on damage. If it is, it can probably kill my Kitty Clarissa. We'll see here. No, it's not on damage. Very interesting. Alright, well, we're returning some debuffs. Uh, Kitty is still looking pretty nice. Oh, he's gonna kill here with Lilius though, right? Oh no, he's attacking! Why is he attacking Champ Z? Wait, you don't want to do that. <laughs> Wait, he threw! He should have killed my Kitty Clarissa. I mean, not that there's much for me to cleanse, but... Um... Let's go for Lilius, she's annoying. Okay, Charles still hasn't taken a turn, by the way. Uh, so let's go for this. And I think Charles is the highest attack, so we're about to just Charles into this right here. <laughs> yeah, he should have killed Kitty Clarissa. I don't know why he went for the champion Zerato. My champ is really tanky, by the way, like 16,000 HP and 1,500 defense. So he had a defense buff too, so it's not like he would be easy to kill. But yeah, um, I think at this point, I think the opponent disconnected. So I guess we'll we'll cut back to to when this fight is over. Actually, no, never mind. Okay, his connection bar is so low. You see that? Okay. Oh, but Charles, Charles, oh, Charles. Okay, doesn't doesn't even matter. Uh, I think he might have disconnected or something there. But yeah, there there we go, guys. <laughs> um, Charles still doing still going ham, still doing his job essentially. Wow, these look at this. These placement uh, matches are so fast, these cues. I love it. I love it. You just jump straight into a game. Uh, do we ban? Yeah, we ban ML Crow. There's, there's no reason to let ML Crow through here. Oh, he's banning Basque. Oh, no, no, I feel bad. <laughs> now I feel bad. Um, I'm, I'm the bad guy here now. Uh, well, I don't know I don't know what he's going to be playing, right? So let's... What, what do I first pick? I don't know. We'll first pick Fire Cecilia. Okay, first pick Fire Cecilia. We'll we'll let him go. All right, we'll see what he picks here. A Tywin, actually, Fire Cecilia is really strong against A, a Tywin. It's one of the reasons I actually built her is uh, for the immunity buff against him. But, all right, we'll see if, if if he's playing Golden Boys here. Oh, FCC. Okay, Fire Cecilia or um, Fallen Cecilia. Uh, wow, I can't, I can't cleave or anything. People are just tanking up, aren't they? So, what do I do? What do I do against A Tywin and FCC? I, I, I still think Alencia is the play here, right? I think we still go Alencia. There's no reason not to. These two units are, I still need to speed tune them a little bit, but I think they're okay. Uh, what else? LQC? I think LQC is a good play here. We'll go LQC. Alright. There we go. Uh, another unit, by the way, that's really nice nowadays for immunity Crimson Armin. She got her buff. Very strong unit now. 
highly recommend you guys build her if you have her. The only downside to her is she has really low base speed, so it's going to be hard to get her um, her to be speed tuned with the rest of your team, right? Ooh, Kron, Cerise. I don't really care about the Cerise there, do I? Not really. But the Kron. But the Kron. Hmm. Cerise and Kron. What do I do? Ooh, I kind, I kind of low key want to use Fire Lytica right here. Yeah, we're gonna bring in Fire Lytica right here. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be fun. Uh, and how do I deal with Cerise? What do I do? Hmm. I guess we can last pick Flitica here, right? We'll last pick Flitica. Why not? We'll see what he goes for next. Yeah, we'll last pick Flitica. Um, how fast would a Cerise be? I don't know. I might ban her. We'll see what this is. Watch her Shuri. Wait, I mean, if I ban this, he can't contest for speed, right? He's gonna ban my Flitica. So, a CR pusher as a last pick, like Flitica, is really strong nowadays. It almost always forces the ban. Wow! He actually went ahead and took out my uh, Fire Lytica. Why? Oh, my Fire Lytica is gonna one shot the Kron. Oh man! All right, you know what? That's okay. We we still got this. We still got this here. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and strip. Oh, that's a fast fire Cecilia and stuff. Interesting. Uh, let's go for defense buff. And we're gonna f uh, s three on our fire Cecilia. It's not gonna provoke because a Talon's gonna cleanse it, but we're gonna get immunity on everybody here. Which is going to be very strong. Alright, yeah, he cleanses the provoke, which is okay. Um, what do I want to do? A Tywin's not going to be able to use his S3, so we're going to reset the FCC here, right? Reset the FCC, and that leaves his Watcher Shuri and stuff very vulnerable, which I think I'm going to kill the Watcher. Yeah. So LQC goes, and now I'm gonna kill the Watcher Shuri. All right, so he's he's gonna hit the LQC. Push me up, actually. Not a very, probably not the smartest idea here. Um, I don't think S1 kills. I'm just gonna go for an S3. I have to kill this Watcher, or else he's gonna like nuke somebody, right? This is a DPS Watcher Shuri. There we go. So he's out of the way. And the thing about LQC is that now she can cycle her immunity, so we'll be good in that regard as well. This team would probably suck against Landy, though. Look at all these buffs. <laughs> oh, we, this, this, this team would die against Landy. Alright, Kron's not doing too much. Again, we're very bulky, right? This team is very, very bulky. We're, we're Bruiser Gang now. No more Cleave. Right? We're Bruiser Gang. So we're gonna... Oh! Oh, that's a counter Kron! Oh, no. That changes things. Uh, we're gonna go into the FCC here. Yeah, that changes things. Um... That's a counter Kron. Let's strip his attack buff here. Oh, okay. Oh, he quit. All right, there we go. I was gonna strip his attack buff with the S2 on Fire Cecilia because that's the EE that I put on her, and she would have put attack down. Actually, no. The A Town would have cleansed the attack down. That's still okay. Very nice. Very nice. Three for three, guys. And you know, it actually is kind of good that we're not, you know, facing against a uh, a bunch of uh, weaker players, right? Uh, we're actually facing against people who are about our level. So they, they have good drafts, they have good units, right? So it's not very one-sided, because that, that would be a little boring to watch. Okay, so let's see what this guy's going for. You're not going for Ice Tywin, are you? Just follow okay, me. Uh, FCC. Kind of makes me just want to go LQC. My LQC is such a bruiser right now. <laughs> I just want to keep testing her. Um, but you know what, let's, let's just do this. Fire Cecilia, we'll debut Kawana in a different video. Um, <laughs> let's just go Alencia again. The defense buff is so good, right? And the Fire Cecilia brings the immunity so much utility from just these two units. I absolutely love them. And also Alencia, 
um, kind of discourages SSB picks, which is actually pretty decent against Fire Cecilia. So I'm very happy with this. Okay, uh, Cerise F10A. Don't we just pick Champ Z and win? All right, we pick Champion Zerato here. Um, Kitty Clursa, Champion Zerato. Hmm. Kitty Clarissa, Champion Zerato, SSB? I don't think I need to pick the SSB here. We'll pick Kitty Clarissa. And then... I kind of just want to go LQC. <laughs> I kind of just want to go LQC. She's so fun. Um, should I go LQC here? You know what? Let's just... Let's give him a run for his money, right? Let's go for Champion Zerato. Don't waste my time. Let's just do the, these two counter picks into him, right? That that shuts down these two right there, um, and we'll be able to last pick a DPS, right? Whatever he picks down here, we'll be able to counter. Uh, C Dom. Oh, so he's cleaving, but but he can't. Um, yeah, he can't. Okay, Arc Demon. Is Arc Demon for the Champion Zerato? That's interesting. Uh, this is an LQC game, though. This is definitely an LQC game. So let's go for LQC right here. And let's ban the C Dom, and we're good. Right? Because he can only ban the Kitty or the Champ Z. He can't ban both. And if he lets both through, then he's screwed. Because um, these two units won't be able to do anything. Even even if they don't S3, that means they're not S3ing, right? Oh! Wow! Okay. So there, is he just not going to pop his S3s? Like, I have two units that counter both of his. Plus, I have more utility in mind. Oh, interesting. He's not even uh, going first here. So let's go ahead and just uh, pop the S2. Okay, didn't really do too much there. What do I do? Do I give my champ immunity? No, I don't. I'm already fine because LQC has immunity. So I'm going to go for the uh, defense break. Very nice. Okay, we landed that. He, his units are very slow. I did not expect that. See how my kitty went? So maybe that's why he he didn't ban the kitty, because he knew that his units were slower, right? But these are these are like 230, 225 speed. Cerise and F10A. That is interesting. Okay. Oh, S3. S3 right now. Do it. Yes. S3. That's what I like to see. No fear. No fear. Alright, there we go. I mean, he does have immunity on his units. Um, ooh, defense break on my LQC. I don't like that. Is he? Who is he going to seal? Seal the champ C. Right? Oh, he's going to try to... Ooh, he sealed my LQC. Okay. Um, we're okay because my, uh, Kitty Clarissa goes, and Champsy counters here. <laughs> Champsy is just going ham. Alright, we're gonna cleanse everything, and then we're, we're good to go. Alright, we're good to go here. So, let's go ahead and kill off, uh, this right here. Okay, get my immunity back up on LQC. Okay, and let's see what this is gonna do. Who's he gonna S1? Ah! Uh, oh! Oh! Whoa! Hang on! That's a dual attack! Okay, we need to get rid of, uh, we need to get rid of this, um, Arc Demon here. We might lose this, actually. <laughs> we might lose this, because Arc Demon exists. Um... He's gonna try to kill Kitty. Oh, dude, what's this? What is it with his dual attacks? Oh my gosh, guys. The dual attacks here are insane. Um, if LQC can kill the Arc Demon, then I think we're good. Oh my god. Dude, look at this. What is this? Excuse me. Excuse me. He's gonna go for LQC. Alright, we're, we're gonna go for this right here. Oh my gosh. Yo, 
this arc demon, man. The dual attacks. All right, there we go. They're they're gone. Now it's over. Champion Zerato can solo the rest of this easy peasy. Jeez. And this is why my LQC is on a tank build. <laughs> Aw, yeah, dude. Take those poisons back. Thank you. And let's get defense buff up. Finally get to take a turn. But it's okay. See, this is why Champ doesn't need speed, right? He just kind of sits there. And the opponent the opponent killed themselves because they didn't ban Champ. Wait, wait, why are you doing this? Don't do this, dude. You're going to get... You're, I mean, I know you get the invincibility, but you're going to get stripped. Ayla Violin. Also, you resisted all the debuff transfers. Uh, <laughs> somehow. Alright. Well well played, Lady Death. Um, but yeah, next time ban Champion Zerato. It's uh, probably not a good idea to let him through if you have, if you have all that. Um, yeah. But hey, there we go. Four out of four Don't right now. Not too bad. Again, like promised, we're going to do five battles here. Let's go for one last battle. And let's see if we can come through. Fire Cecilia... I mean, she didn't do too much that battle, but she was taking a lot of the focus fire. She's kind of like FCC in that regard. When people see her, they're like, gotta focus her down, right? Because her kit is so strong. Alright, so let's see. Uh, we go for... Let's just keep banning ML Crow. I mean, I don't know what I want to ban here. If I wanted to pick Kawana, I'd probably ban SSB. But let's see. Band F10A. Uh, hmm. I don't... You know what? We built her, right? We built her, and she's actually a really good first pick. It's actually not a bad first pick, so let's go for her. Fire Cecilia. You can take the Fallen Cecilia. Ooh, no! He goes for Cerise. Okay. Yeah, there we go. Uh, Fallen Cecilia. He got the skin. Very nice. Respectable. Uh, what do we go for? Cerise? Cerise first pick? Interesting. We could go, like, ML Rin. Hmm... Let's go Alencia. Let's just keep going with this duo, because I think they're working, right? They're working quite well. And for Fallen Cecilia, I might just pick LQC here. Let's pick LQC. Mm, or do we? Yes, we do. LQC provides, uh, provides bulk, right? Because she has a built-in adamant for the team. Ooh, he's going for the long con. Oh my gosh, SSB and Ruel. I mean, at this point, I could just go Rowana, right? I could go Rowana. Hmm. Yeah, I could go Rowana here. Let's go. I actually regeared mine as well. Let's go Rowana, and we need another damage dealer. Uh, who would be who would be decent as a damage dealer here? Hmm. Or should I go Kitty Clarissa? Nah, I don't. I don't think I need Kitty Clarissa. Um, Rowana has uh, the ability to cleanse as well, so we'll we'll just stick with this. Uh. Oh, should we have some fun? Uh, actually, I could go Charles. You know what? Let's go Charles. We'll fight the first four. This is probably going to be a long fight because Ruel exists, but let's go Charles. I just want to have some fun. Yeah, we'll just ban this Dizzy. And we're good, right? Oh, he banned the Rowana. Um, that's okay, actually. Yeah, that's okay. I'm okay with this. Because we have immunity coming in from Fire Cecilia, and... Yeah. Yeah, yeah. We're good. So he's going to open with an S3, right? Yeah, there we go. That's fine. I don't care about the restrict and uh, decrease speed. Oh, and LQC resisted. Okay, very nice. Let's go ahead and strip all of their buffs here. Defense buff for the team. And uh, Fire Cecilia, hopefully. Okay. Fire Cecilia, let's go. Come on. Immunity for the team. You have 100% effectiveness. Let's go. Provoke. Ah, oh, we provoked the rule well, actually. That's huge. Okay, I'll take that. I will take that. Uh, who do we go for? Do we go for the SSB? No, we go for the Ruel, right? We go for the... We go for the FCC. <laughs> Let's go for it. Hopping it early. Let's test how tanky you are. Okay. Uh, respectable. 
Oh, but Charles. Oh, Charles, come on. Charles. Charles is gonna do your thing. Um, maybe we should have gone for Ruel. But we wouldn't have done that much damage to Ruel uh, if we went for her. Alright, come on, Charles. Oh, this is a squishy SSB. Alright, clap the SSB here. No! Okay. Uh, let's go for her. Let's go for SSB. Uh, we're gonna force the Ruel to pop a revive on this SSB here. Okay, let's go for that. Yeah, she's gone. Okay. Um, no reason to S2 here for the attack down. Let's go for the defense break. Nope, no defense break there. Everyone still has immunity, right? This is why she's so strong. Um, fire Cecilia. Okay, come on, Charles. Yes! Alright, Charles, do it! Clap her! Ah, oh, he didn't. Okay, but that's okay. We'll pop the S3 here. Hopefully this kills the FCC. She's on Aureus. Oh, we we're so close. It killed the Cerise, actually. Two units down. So here's the here's the problem with Ruel right now, is that if the rest of the team's dead, Ruel doesn't do anything. So he can revive somebody, like SSB here, but if I kill his Fallen Cecilia, the SSB doesn't have damage sharing anymore, and he's in a very vulnerable spot, right? So he can't do much. Um, I don't think... He, oh, he does have his S3. I don't know why he soul burned that. Because uh, it decreases the cooldowns, right? So I don't know why he did that. He should have just went for S3 and saved the soul burn for Ruel or something. Alright, well let's, let's take out this Fallen Cecilia here. We got Mind's Eye. Alright, and now SSB is, uh, is left just alone here, right? So I don't think she can do much. Let's go for this. No defense break, very sad. And who's she gonna focus down? Okay, she's gonna focus down my Fire Cecilia. Ruel's gonna heal herself, right? Yep. Um... Ooh, you know what? I have the attack buff. I'm just gonna hold off on S3ing. We, we healed enough there, right? With Sigurds. Let's get defense buff on everybody. Just want to make sure I keep immunity on my LQC so she doesn't get defense broken. And Charles is so slow. Yeah, Charles is so so slow. He still has his, so we're okay. All right. Uh, we're just no. Let's not soul burn that. Let's go for a defense break on Ruel. Come on, three three misses there. 40% chance defense break, but that's okay. Oh yes, Charles. Come on. Oh, no follow-up. We still haven't had a follow-up here. Let's finish off the SSB, and then it's game. Alright, that's a defense break there. Fine's eye kicks in. Oh, I'm loving this core though. This core right here is so, so strong. I'm just gonna defense break. No! Four times in a row. Um, but by core I mean... Fire Cecilia and Alencia is such a good duo to open with for me, uh, at least with today's testing, right? LQC is also a very strong addition because of her passive making the team bulkier, and plus she's just a great overall damage dealer, so there you guys go, and then the last unit's always flexible in that regard. Uh, yeah, so there you guys have it. Five placement matches in the preseason, just testing out some new units, new combinations, right? And I'm loving Fire Cecilia. But with that being said guys, thank you all so much for watching this video, I really do appreciate it. If you enjoy it, please leave a like, subscribe for more Epic 7 content, and leave a comment down below letting me know what I can do to improve. And until next time, take care.